welcome back everyone for some more Spyro 3 Year of the Dragon. And we are going to be playing the fourth and final Speedway level in this game, which is Harbor Speedway here at Midnight Mountain. So, uh, and like all the other w ones, I'm just going to do the time attack and I'll show you guys where Hunter is. But uh, anyway, hope you guys have a great day today. Hope you guys have a good Sunday. Uh, actually, no. No, 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 no. No, I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry about that. Today's still Friday. By the time you guys are still watching... By the time you guys are watching this, it'll be, or should I say, by the time this is uploaded, it'll be Friday. Now, the Sparks levels, which I will begin in the next episode, that will be on Sunday, but it's still Friday right now, which I do apologize for that. For those of you who may not, may not already know, I do record these ahead of time, so if I mess up the days, I truly apologize for that. But uh, without further ado, let's go to Herbert Speedway. Yeah, I don't know why I said Sunday. <laughs> Especially in the last video, I said I'll see you guys in 20 minutes. And I said I hope you guys have a good Friday. Sorry about that. But yeah, I like, because of my work schedule, I have to record all my content ahead of time whenever I get what little free time I have left, unfortunately, so... Yeah, we're not racing the boobies. <laughs> we're we're going to be doing the time attack. This may take multiple tries, I don't know. This is actually a pretty neat speedway, I do have to admit, even though I'm not a real big fan of speedway levels. To me, speedway levels stopped being fun after the first game. At least get some of the crab right off the bat. Now let's focus on the arches. Puts me in mind of North Cove a little bit. I know I said that in the, about Agent Nine's lab. That one kind of puts me in mind of North Cove's level. But actually, to come to think of it, this maze kind of puts me in mind of a mixture of um, Metro Speedway, North Cove, and Twilight Harbor. Of course, Metro Speedway was from Spyro 2. Twilight Harbor and North Cove are from the first game. Oh! I didn't get to pull up there. Yeah, let's retry that. Yeah, I took a big L there. through the arches again. Yeah, I, I, I would have been very surprised if I'd managed to do this in the first try. Oh, I, I think I missed that one. I missed that one. Wow, okay. Whoa! Yeah, that was going real fast. I think my best bet there is just to go with them. I mean, any original game I could go against them, but because of how gliding is in a Reignited, Reignited Trilogy, then I think I'm just going to go with them. Yeah, this one's kind of giving me a bit of issues, but like I said before, I've been shocked if I've been doing this first try. Because this is a rather tricky speedway. Okay, 
this too. Wow. Okay, this one's this one's giving me trouble. This one is really giving me trouble. Hey there, mad gamer. But yes, first wasn't kidding about saying the best races are here because this this particular speedway is no joke. Come on, Spyro, you can pull up faster than that! God, he was like a grandpa there pulling up! Do the sardines next. Okay, well now we gotta do the crabs. As long as I don't mess this up, we should be good. There we go, with five seconds to spare. But yeah, this speedway, like I said before, this speedway is no joke. And that's not even the intended way you're supposed to do that, by the way. The way I completed it just there is not the intended way you're supposed to do that, but uh, I managed to do it anyway. I will show you guys where Hunter is. Hey there, Kobe. We're gonna do the time attack again. Okay, now we gotta go over here. You guys probably noticed this lighthouse before. It did have an opening. And you probably guess who's in this opening. And you probably guess what his issue is. Where do these flying sheep saucers keep coming from? I just saw another one grab an egg and fly off. This one's super fast, but his saucer is damaged and it's leaving smoke rings. I think I can keep up with them as long as I can make it through those rings. I'm gonna chase him down. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm only gonna try this once. Of course, it starts off pretty easy, and then it gets trickier. Make sure you have the same altitude as the UFO, and you'll have a good shot at getting this. Barely got that one.
Oh, I missed that. Well, of course it. Where do these flying sheep saucers keep coming from? But at least you got the idea. I'm not doing that again. But what? You're kidding. We gotta hurry. He's getting away. Man, yeah, we'll get him another time. Hey, you're not the one that had to do that time trial. But anyway, that is the fourth and final speedway done. We are done with the speedway levels. Now all we gotta do is the sparks levels. And of course, we're gonna be going back to... Sunrise Spring, and we're going to be doing the Sparks double there to kick things off on Sunday's doubleheader. Hopefully you guys are looking forward to that. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this. Hope you guys are enjoying this series. I'll be seeing you guys again next time. And don't be rude. <laughs>